point. You That's just bad. Bad. You bitch. bad. 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 Bitch. I feel good. This is so you Tony Robbins. Botox for like a few years. The first like couple of years of filming, I was like, no. And then I started seeing the makeup and my like, seep into my lines, and, and it was yeah. horrifying. Emotions are overrated. Yeah. Can we talk about like how people are getting the alien eyes? Because I want them. Allegedly, okay. to get your eyes to look like slanted cat eyes, they stick a needle down into your face and they like pull it up and snip it. Also, what's f***ed up is you don't even need a doctor to do it. You can get well, it like, done by I a could do nurse. It. Let's no. try that. We'll see, that's also the problem. problem. Just give me a lighter and a needle, <laughs> and I'll make it. Here's my friend's ear. I used to pierce people's ears. Yeah. I could thread your face. Easy. Song title or sex position? In, in the bushes. Three, oh, damn. Seven, two, one. I feel like that has to be like way too <laughs> obvious to be a sex position. If you're from Canada, it's... this is like a Tuesday. <laughs> ah! I mean. <laughs> I had sex in the bushes at my prom while my parents were watching. In Canada, when you graduate high school, they throw a bush party. It's called safe grad, and they take you on the yellow school buses, and they all drive you out, and the parents make a protective ring. And I definitely had sex against a tree at the prom. Sure? Becca, have you ever had business sex? It's a new term I just coined. Every, most encounters are a business, business sex. Oh, like a transactional Business sex. is like a transactional sex. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, I need to get this done so that well, I can yeah. get some dinner. So that leads me into one of mine. I said, oh. do you like a man who's just forward and direct? So if a guy just came up and said, hey, tonight I'm just looking to have sex with you, what would your response be? Would you feel like that was inappropriate to say, or would you respect him saying that? What does he look like? <laughs> <laughs> now, when you did the lift, yeah. was that happiness? Oh, you have no idea. Because, like, I used to feel like my boob, it was like a pancake just laying on my stomach. They were, like, double D? They were double Ds. I got like a small D, and now they're I can fit oh, in double D. Oh my god, now. it's really hard. Yeah, I it's look like so obese. Hard. Yes, one hundred percent with Brang Brad. So Beautiful. I'm going to name some of the men that you have unapologetically worked with. Say the first word that comes to mind, like Ooh, a quick this like is fun. Oh, Okay, ready? <gasps> Simon Cowell. Boot cut. Ti. Hot. Hot. Okay. <laughs> Fifty. Fifty cent. Bad. Bitch. Oh. Can I tell you why? Yeah. When I did my music video right there with him, he he's always trying to just lift me up and empower me. And he's like, I want you to remember, you that bad bitch. And I was like, I am. He's like, you that bad bitch. And I was like, I'm that bad, bad bitch. I didn't quite grasp it at first, but yeah. he was basically saying, just don't ever forget who you are and you're the baddest bitch in the game. You know I'm what? I think this is time for couples therapy. Please grab your partner's hands. Jack, Becca, are we going this way? Okay. okay, ready? Let's do it to each other. I don't want to no, be my partner. No, you're my partner. You that bad. You that bad. Bitch. Say it with me, Jack. Oh, she did a point. You That's a bad, bad bitch. Bad. Oh, I feel good. This is so you Tony Robbins. Bad.